Texas Governor Greg Abbott, a Republican, argues that the Biden administration is failing to stop undocumented immigrants from crossing the U.S.-Mexico border. Months ahead of the November presidential election, Abbott's efforts to deter undocumented migrants are now at the core of a fierce political debate over immigration. The governor says Texas would relinquish control of parts of the border immediately if President Joe Biden took stronger steps to stop this people from crossing illegally. Biden. The Texas National Guard, uh, they're undertaking operations to expand this effort. We're not going to contain ourselves just to this park. Uh, we are expanding to further areas to make sure that we will expand our level of deterrence and denial of illegal entry into the United States. As the governor delivered his speech, protesters from both sides of the debate faced off on the streets of Eagle Pass. USA! One side included USA! mainly those who planned to vote for Donald Trump to return to the White House. They support the governor's efforts to block immigrants from entering Texas. Daniel DeMora was born in the United States and raised in Brazil. He calls undocumented immigrants criminals. This is a country of Americans, so we are not supposed to, to be uh, the, 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 the place of the world to accept every single immigrant. They could go to other places, like uh, Europe, for, for example, too. Nuestra Across the street, a group of mostly Mexican-American protesters vocally pushed back, showing their support for immigrants. They call Governor Abbott's approach racist. Josie Papas, a lifelong resident of Eagle Pass, takes a softer approach. Border cities love each other. We consider the, our border city, we call it our sister city. You come and tell us something like that, we're gonna say, what, where are you from? Because we get along. We get along on both sides of our border. Both sides of Rio Grande get along. As immigration takes center stage in the lead up to the U.S. presidential election, migrants continue to make their way to the United States. And that is supercharging this already heated debate. Frank Contreras, CGTM, Eagle Pass, Texas.